Welcome back to Forza Horizon 3 and today we have my proper call to my drag tune for the R34 GTR. Now the last tune I did I V8 swapped it for some reason I guess I was just going for the quickest tune possible but in reality nobody really wants that so today I've got you a twin turbo RB26 tune. I think it's getting around 750 odd horsepower which is a bit stupid because they should really change this game that you can tune this engine to its potential because that's nowhere near what this engine can actually do. But it's the best you can get in this game, unfortunately. So if you'd like to download this tune I've got, it's called TT for Twin Turbo RB26 Quarter Drag, I think. Or if you're struggling to find it like that, just put my gamer tag in. Now, I know the body kit isn't making it any quicker because it just adds extra weight, but I just like the look of the Nismo body kit. You don't need to put it on, and I've kept the wing on there because I just don't like it without the wing. I just think it looks weird. But I've kept the uh, wing on and the body kit, as you've seen. So it does slow it down a little, but not much. But if you like another body kit or don't like the body kit, just change it to whatever you want because it's not going to make any difference, really. So, uh, And the way you want to launch this thing is obviously manual with clutch. Hold it at like 7,000 RPM. It's weird because the launch is like just on the edge on this. You've got to get it perfect really. If you go any over 7,000 you're going to spin the wheels too much. The way it launches is that there will be like a tiny bit of wheel spin. You'll see it on the ground after you launch. It's about like a square 10 centimeters long or something. Where the wheel just initially launches. That's the quickest way to launch it. And you'll see from the video that the video, the clip coming up that that's pretty much a 7,000 RPM. So uh, that's it from me, and I hope you enjoy the clip. 